today? No. Can I see your ID? You see my ID, Mr. Bennett? And this is your what? I haven't seen your ID. You went to show me. You went to show me your ID. Yeah, you seen the ID, Mr. Bennett. It's 42 Shadoli Street. Okay. Did you drive here in your own car today? I did. Are you insured for business? It's a, it's a company car. Is it a company car? That's okay. Do you mind if I write a number plate there? Do you mind if I record you was on? You can record me all you want. I'm just making sure you're abiding by the law. Why are you covering your face? Sure you work for a company? You work for BBC? You're a public worker? I've got loads of things to do today. But you wrapped my door. I'm glad you admitted that. You work for BBC, you did. You knocked my door. I'm taking away your right of access, your implied right of access. Do not wrap my door again. That's okay. Right? But you know you will appear in court now. I'll appear in court? Uh -huh. You don't even know my name yet. Mr. Bennett, you just confirmed it. Mr. Bennett? You don't know how to spell it? Can you spell Mr. Bennett? There's loads of Mr. Bennett's in Belfast. Well, uh, Mr. Bennett. Did you drive your own car here today? When I go back to my house, what, sorry? Did you issue me with a threat? Tell me to go back to my house or something? I told you to go back to your house. Why? What are you going to do? If I don't, did you drive your car here today? Did you drive your own car here today? Is it insured for business purpose? It's a company car. That's okay then. I'm going to write your number plate down. And I want to know from BBC whether you're insured to do business in it. I'm going to phone your insurance company then. I'm going to do a tax check on it now uh, to make sure you're taxed and MOT'd for the drive on the road. You do that then. There's just BBC scum. You, you, you came to my door looking for a woman. You've got nothing better to do. I've got nothing better to do than warn people who you are. You work for the BBC, you're a scumbag. I don't work for the BBC. You do work for, who do you work for then? Your TV licensing. Right, that's okay. You just prey on fucking pregnant women. You just prey on women that live in the house. You came to my house looking for a woman. You work for BBC and you scam money off people. You just produce fake news and you come to my house looking for money. This is a public building, by the way. This is a public building, by the way. It's a public building in here. You can't get away from me in here. You came to my door looking for a, a woman. You came to my house looking for a single woman. I can call the police. You can call the police, that's okay. You came to my door looking for me. A signal's not going to cut off. This is a public building in here. What are you kicking me for? You are You just kicked me. That's a public building. You followed me to my door. You came and knocked my door. Would you please leave? I'm not leaving. You drove a car to my house today to see me. And you won't even let me see what car you're driving. You're telling me you're insured for business purpose. He came and knocked my door. He came and knocked my door, and I'm recording him. Huh? It's a secure door. No, he came and knocked my door. He works for BBC. He says he has a right to phone the police, but he won't. I'm not letting the lift go. Look, he's came to my door looking money off me. Can you ask him to leave? He works for a TV license, mate. He's a public officer, and this is a public building. I need to go upstairs. Could you ask him? You don't need. You were at my door. You just knocked my door. I'm putting you all over YouTube now, so everybody needs to be asking. You can phone the police then. You ring a place. I'll be waiting outside to make another video of who you are. I'll be showing everybody in East Belfast who you are.